Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Samsung has started rolling out an all new update to its clock application, which brings in a couple of new changes. So in this video, we are going to take a look at all those changes, which enhances or improves the usability of this application. Before we go ahead, if you're new on the channel and if you'd like to know your phone better, then this is the channel you should subscribe. Go ahead, smash the subscribe button and give this video a like if you find this video useful. Now let's go ahead. Let me just scroll down and show you the version number. This is the latest version we have 12.1.15.12. The update size is about 25.51 MB. As you can see, this update has arrived on my device on 20th April 2022. Now coming to the change log, it says preset timers for 10, 15, 30 minutes are provided as default. The upcoming alarm notification option has been added to the settings menu. The widget background color has been partially improved. The other feature improvements and bug fixes have been applied. Let me just quickly elaborate this to you. As you can see on the Note 20 Ultra on the left hand side has the older version of clock application and on the right hand side the S22 Ultra has the newer version of the clock. Both these devices are on dark mode. I will press and hold on the widget on both the phones and go to settings. Now you see day and night colors I have turned on on both these phones and I'll save it. On the previous version, we have got the light mode on this widget and on the newer version, we have got this grayish mode on this widget. Now, if you want this widget to be in a light color or light mode, then you will have to turn on the light mode on the phone. Now, let me just turn on the light mode here. As you can see, now these widgets are on light mode. This is how it works with this all new update. Okay, now let's move to the next one. Let's tap on this three dots button and go to settings. As you can see under alarm, we have got upcoming alarm notification. This is a new option which has been added here on the clock setting. Let me just tap on this. As you can see, it says when customization service is on, upcoming alarm notification appear when you wake up instead of the time selected on the screen. Now this is interesting. Let me just explain this to you now. Let's go back. As you can see here on the clock settings, we have got customization service option under privacy settings. Let me just tap on this. Here I have turned on the customization service for clock. Now let me just go back to this all new setting upcoming alarm notification. It says when customization service is on upcoming alarm notification appear when you wake up instead of the time selected on the screen, which means since I have selected customization service on these time selections will not work because the customization service will know that you are awake and it will show you the upcoming alarm notification there. Now, if you have turned off this customization service, we can select these intervals for the notification to appear on your phone, which is going to work even if you're not awake. You will be notified about the upcoming alarm in the notification section at the set time before the alarm rings. That is how this whole thing works. Now the last one is preset timers for 10, 15, 30 minutes are provided as default on the clock. This is what has been mentioned in the change log. However, I was not able to see these preset timers in the timer section on the clock. Let me show you that. Now we have got the previous version on the left hand side and on the right hand side, we have got the current or the latest version of clock. Let me go to timer. Here on both the versions, you can see we have got default timer as 10 minutes. And I don't see this new 10, 15, 30 minutes of default or the preset timers on the new version. When we tap on this plus button on both the versions, we get to select or add preset timers here, but I don't see these three default settings for the timer. Now I'm not very sure whether I am wrong here in finding out this particular new feature or whether Samsung has not provided it with this update. Despite mentioning it in the change log, I'm not very sure. So if you're able to find this out, do let me know in the comment section below whether you are able to see these three new default timers on the latest version of the clock. These are the changes we have with this all new update for your Samsung clock. This update may not be available in all regions or may not be available for all the devices. So be wary of that. I have received it on the S22 Ultra and the Note 20 Ultra. Uh, the Note 10 Plus has not received this update yet. So if you haven't got it, wait for it patiently. You will be getting this update very soon or you may not get it at all. So this depends on Samsung. That's all I want to share with you guys in this video. I hope you have already subscribed to the channel and smash that like button for this video. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye. Thank you.